Hello, my name is Drew Mang, and I'm here today in the beautiful showroom for Imagine Backyards in Scottsdale, Arizona. I'm here today to learn the story from Ken Jacuzzi that became the inspiration for what is this great company and a great brand. So welcome, Ken. Thank you, good to be here. Uh, excellent. The family originated in Italy. The oldest sons then started immigrating gradually to the United States. They ended up in Southern California picking fruit, the fruit orchards. Eventually the family migrated north to the Bay Area and specifically Berkeley, California. And they established a machine shop and they started manufacturing various things, including um, airplane propellers. They continued uh, designing and inventing and, uh, and they had another design for the first enclosed cabin plane. They had also designed a pump that would help lift water in terms of volume and capacity. They decided to start manufacturing the pumps. That's how the company basically got started. The company really grew. They were quite successful. In 1941, I was the last of, of my mother and dad's four children. Just before I turned two years old, I contracted uh, strep throat. The strep throat evolved into rheumatic fever. The rheumatic fever evolved into juvenile rheumatoid arthritis, which affects the whole body, not just the joints. I had a rheumatologist. They utilized the hydrotherapy tanks, the stainless steel ones. And my mother noticed that uh, that I was indeed more comfortable and pain-free and flexible after the hydrotherapy. So she asked my dad, can you come and take a look at this thing? Maybe you can make something for the bathtub at home. He designed a unit for our home bathtub. He invited the doctor to our house to see the unit. And he said, this is great. He said, he said why don't you make them and, and, and market them for other people who could benefit from hydrotherapy? So they got into the business and they started manufacturing them and selling them through dealers. You feel almost immediately, I mean, really, pain reduction and flexibility, and the buoyancy of water, the water combined with the, with the massage and the warm water and the whole thing, it really feels good. Yeah, and your rheumatoid arthritis constricts you. It limits your range of motion. And now that I'm 74, my range is much more limited. But the hydrotherapy has, has really you know, allowed me to live a normal lifespan, uh, which is kind of amazing if you think about it. It is really incredible. Yeah, particularly yeah. since my folks were told when I contracted the arthritis uh, that I wouldn't live to be three years old. The air and the water, now the two were combined with the uh, hydrotherapy device. It's always been one of the um, keys to our design, an important part of it. Air adds to the water and, and vice versa. They have a synergistic effect. I got the benefit more of my entire body than I did in the hospital. But even most importantly, I was able to get that benefit every day rather than just a couple of days a week. When the brand became known almost overnight, um, it kind of rubbed off on the rest of the family and, and they enjoyed that. So they, they even started using the product more and more themselves. Um, and they thought, yeah, that's pretty good deal, you know. I think that's an interesting story, how the uh, name became so well known. This program that was big in, in daytime was called Queen for a Day. Would you like to be queen for a day? Yeah. The perfect way to relax, it's with a jacuzzi whirlpool bath. The incredible thing about it was that this show garnered a audience average of about 20 million viewers. The name became known nationwide. It became an overnight brand. I think it is universally recognized even to this day as being a name that is associated with uh, something that is pleasurable. The legacy and the innovation to see this continued today. It honors the family. Making a company successful and keeping it successful is for everyone to continue uh, working together.